All right, I have a lot of great questions on that last video about how serving sizes are determined. So on cookies, why would one package say one cookie? Why would another package say four cookies? So these are based on um, the FDA sets what are called reference amounts customarily consumed, otherwise known as RACCs, and these are based on different product categories. So for example, the RACC for cookies is 30 grams. So this is gonna be standardized across cookies. They're going to be somewhere around 30 grams. And then you need to also list the number of pieces or the number of cookies in this case that comes closest to 30 grams. So for example, I have three different Girl Scout cookies here. Thin mints are four cookies, 32 grams. Shortbread, four cookies, 26 grams. And then caramel delights, two cookies, 28 grams. So obviously different types of cookies weigh less or more than other cookies. So the caramel delights, there's only two cookies per serving because those are more dense, they weigh more. So you get less per 30 grams. And the reason why those aren't all exactly 30 grams is because it's the number of whole cookies that come closest to 30 grams. So they might not be exactly 30 grams. If you have two cookies that weigh 26 grams, that's going to be the closest amount of whole cookies to 30 grams. Otherwise you'd get really weird servings like two and one third cookies or, or something like that. So um, that's why they're not all going to be exactly 30 grams. The RACC for some products is based on volume. So for ice cream, the RACC is two thirds cup, and then you just list the number of grams that are in that two thirds cup based on the product. So more premium brands are actually gonna be more dense because they have less air incorporated into them. And so those ones in many cases are going to be more weight because again, it's based on that two thirds cup. So you might see a more premium brand with a lot more calories per serving, fat per serving. And that's just because you're getting more per cup. So it's more dense. So it's really not the case that companies, um, I mean, companies pretty much follow the RACC. And so it's pretty standardized across these. I mean, there's a whole list of different categories on here. So it's pretty detailed. You know, there's crackers, there's sweets, there's candy, there's just a bunch of different types of products. And I'll link this in the comments as well. So you can go take a look at it. But um, so yeah, companies aren't just like making up their own serving sizes. That's not to say that these serving sizes are necessarily what somebody is going to eat in a sitting, but nutrition is based on the serving size. So if you are going to eat two servings, you can just multiply all the nutrients by two. So that's what it's based on. And it's not just random. That's why Crackers, you'll kind of see the same 30 grams. Cookies, you'll see 30 grams. Um, so these are pretty standardized across categories.